Only a small percentage of ancient Egypt population was literate, namely the pharaoh, the members of the royal family, officials, and scribes. The scribe's profession was transmitted from father to son, and it was very popular, very respected, and lucrative. Scribes had careers in the government, army, accounting, and priesthood. They began their training at an early age. Their training took place inside of a building called the House of Life attached to temples. Scribes wrote on stone or clay sherds, wooden boards, linen, papyrus, and parchment. Almost all our known knowledge about ancient Egyptians came from the work and art of the ancient Egyptian scribe. Toth was the ancient Egyptian god of the scribes and science. It was hard to learn the hieroglyphs and they were considered holy writing. For this reason, they didn't share their knowledge. Scribes had the opportunity to take a high rank in the society, and that brought them wealth and power. Hormheb was initially a scribe, and he became a pharaoh. Nebaman was a scribe who was very influential.